the roller today. Get my feet set in. We're stretching and a bit of rolling. Ready for the coda. Okay, I've made my pizza and I'm now checking the temperature of the middle. I was hoping by now it would be about 400 because it's been probably 15 minutes, but I just got a bit more to go. Oh, it's turned out to be a lovely day. Blue sky. I did say that I wouldn't talk about the weather. <laughs> I did say that I wouldn't, you know, like go on about the weather, but I think it's really important when you're cooking outside, unless you live in a, like in a place that's got perfect weather every day. I live in a country where weather is a big deal. All I, all most of us do in the UK is check the weather. It's like a big issue for us <laughs> over here. Um, checking the weather is the first thing we do in the morning and the last thing we do when you go to bed. It's just like a British thing, checking the weather. And so if I do go on about the weather a lot, it's because it's so unpredictable over here. And you know, one minute it's like raining, so I'll show you. Like one minute, it's, look, it's been pouring. And then and then next it's sunny. And, and the thing is, the weather forecasting isn't predictable, so even though you're told it's not going to rain, it does. So I think that's the problem. And it's just something that you need to be aware of. And that's why I do take a big interest in the weather because I'm cooking outside. And it does have an impact on, you know, what I do, how long, for, when I cook. I'm just... So let me just check this. Looking at the timer on my video, it's been about, it's been three minutes. It's coming up to four minutes. And it's, it's hitting 4.09. That's just really low. And I can't get a good base on that cook if I put it in now. So hopefully that base is gonna stand. It's quite thin because I used the roller. I'm hoping it doesn't seep through now. So this is the first time I've cooked with the Coda for a week or two. I've been cooking with the Pro and I love my Uni Pro. I love cooking with wood. Um, I love cooking with wood because the logs are very different. They're very hot. I just love the way that it burns at the back and the fantastic flame that you've got. It's quite mesmerizing. There's something about cooking with wood. I didn't think I'd like cooking with wood, to be honest, because I've never done that before, before having a pizza oven. I've never cooked with wood. But there is something about it, and until you try it, it's difficult to explain the experience. So when people ask me, oh, why do you like cooking with wood over gas? It's, I don't, it's like going back to basics, isn't it? Uh, something very 
It's like when you sit and have a log fire in your house. You just it's mesmerized by it and it's it's so powerful and and it's more than just the cook. It's more than just the pizza when you you use a wood fired oven. It's about real outdoor cooking then, something different. But if you just want to cook a pizza, then gas is the way to go. And let's see where we are here. I can start to smell cooking my pizza outside, so I think the heat is getting stronger. Right, it's just 4-4. Four, four. I'm going to go with that. It's 4-4-5 four, four, at the top of that roomy circle. So I'm going to put this in. Oh, no, I'm not. <laughs> I'm going to turn it down. I've learned from my mistakes in the past on this one. So let's just turn this down. Not much. I'm going to turn it down to sort of halfway. And if I need to turn it back up again, I will. Let's just get this in. And I've got my my rock box peel, my Gosney peel, I've got that back for this oven. So that's cool. I know that the stone, one thing about going back to my wood fired oven is that the stone um, is a lot hotter at the front than the coda. So if you want to know what the difference is between cooking with a coda and cooking with wood, that with wood you can put the door on and so your stone is a lot hotter at the front with the gas you can't put a door on gas ovens generally so you are cooking with a, a cooler stone at the front wow look at that look how fast that cooked i can't even remember putting that part to the flame This is cooking really quick. I'm not going to mess around with this. I could easily burn it. Let's just check where we are. A little bit there. Yeah, done. Nice base from the coda there. Give that a try. Mm. Nice. Yummy meatballs. 
very nice. That's the best base I've made on the coda so far. It's golden. Show you there. Nice. Very tasty pizza. I love the meatballs on here and I think it's cooked the, the base really well. My toppings on this pizza, meatballs in like a, like a bolognese sauce, mozzarella, buffalo mozzarella, beautiful basil leaves, some mixed herbs and a bit of garlic powder on top and some parmesan cheese just to finish off. Very tasty, very nice.